want to go get ice cream. But we need to put some pants on first, Lyndall. Because you, what did you just do? Hey, ice cream. You got to be careful how soon you say ice cream. Like how many minutes before? If it's still a half hour away, you shouldn't even say ice cream. I was trying to bribe her into coming out to get a diaper on. Rookie, rookie mistake. Yeah. We're gonna go to the car. We have a young couple. I don't think we're a young couple no. anymore. We're not? <laughs> no. Since when? 35? I'm not 35. You're not, but I am. I'm a young couple. Anyway, our church is having a young couple, young family, young couples, I guess, um, ice cream social at Andy's, which is my favorite custard. It's custard, right? Which is my favorite. And we have, we've literally never taken the kids to go get ice cream. So this is a first for them. Pretty exciting. I know Bear's excited. And Little's excited. Before we head up to Andy's though, let's take a look and see what Doug the Builder did on the addition today. Well, he cleaned up the floor, so that's nice. So we are doing a recessed ceiling, so I know he did more work. You got it, Bear? So I, did, I know he did more work up there. It's pretty cool. So he's actually going to match our bedroom. We thought we were only going to match the living room, but he's actually going to match the bedroom, which is even better. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh -oh, what? Oh, no. Oh, no, what? There's a mess there. That looks about it. That's about all that he did today. Got it prepped because tomorrow the windows are going in. Oh yeah, Andy. Yeah, I don't know if he did that yesterday. Frame the door. Hey, hey. hey We're on Bob. our way to get ice cream and we ran across a pedestrian. <laughs> yeah, there's another one down there. There he is. There he is. Uh, old ball hawker. Yeah. Um, I think he wants you guys to bring him something back. Oh, we will. Planned on it. But you don't need to bring me anything. What? Well, maybe I'll uh -huh. do just, tonight. Just a small. Okay. Just a small. It's a special week. The diet starts after Rachel delivers. Then it starts for everyone. That's right. Oh, well, I'm going to get a little head start. Okay. Since you moved the pictures up. Oh, yeah. That's true. Uh-huh. Bless you, man. I got to tell Brad about that. All right. Right side, I got more balls than I can put in these two pockets. And I left <laughs> balls. Really? Wow. Jeez. Bunch of bad golfers. Right. Who, who is that? Are any of them your own? Nope. <laughs> ah, good one. I feel like somebody needs. We should probably get that for free. Okay, we're back on. We're back on track. That was sad. It was all falling off the side. Lindell, is that funny? Do you want to wear this for a little bit? Thank you. Oh, you do I. Boo bear. <laughs> bear. Lindel. Yum. Is that good? Do you like the vanilla or the chocolate? Yes. Yes, me too. So Brad tried to feed me a bite and that happened. It, perfectly on the landing pad. <laughs> Not bad. That's not embarrassing at all. Just nine months pregnant with ice cream on my shirt. <laughs> Lindell, do you like the vanilla? Yes. Do you like the chocolate? Do you like the chocolate one? Ooh. Yum. More, please. Got it? Mmm. <laughs> Nine oh two p.m. It's time to put together this new. Let's see how long it takes. It took about two minutes to undo all the tape. It's packaged very well, and our dog Rusty is no help whatsoever. Mm -hmm. 
well it's pretty and it's a heck of a lot heavier than it looks and those legs are pretty darn heavy rusty is still not very much help extremely simple to put the legs on as you would expect for such such an expensive piece of equipment lining up the arrows screw it in pretty easy is this going in bear or lindell's room Thank you. Setup was extremely easy. Started at 9.02. It is 9.12. 10 minute setup. It's done. It's done. Wow. I'm sleep in it tonight. <laughs> I hope our baby's cuter than that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's a pretty cute baby. Yeah, it is really cute baby. It's like, that's really long though. The baby? Yeah. Yeah, it's a long baby. Oh, it's like vibrating. Is it really? Yeah. I seriously need oh, to get yeah. a better night's sleep in this. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty sturdy. You feel and it has a white noise. So cry, cry and see what it does. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't notice any change. Me neither. Did you download the app yet? No. Do you remember... What's his name? Carp? Harvey Carp or something? The Who? guy that invented this? Oh, yeah. Dr. Carp? Dr. Carp. I think it's Harvey. Harvey Carp. Do you remember? You probably don't because you slept through it. I did fall asleep. The happiest baby on the block? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, we watched that when the twins were like... A week old to try to like figure out how to soothe them. Mm -hmm. And we fell asleep. And I fell asleep. Mm -hmm. And then you didn't know the five S's. I mean, you can't blame me. The twins were like a week old. They were definitely more swollen for the twins. Yes, they were. We should do a side by side comparison with that picture. All right. Look at those sausage toes. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ugh. You know what? It'll get worse too in the hospital when they have that IV. I think the best thing that happened to me after I gave birth to the twins. I say gave can you say gave birth if you had a C section? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you can. Yeah. Yeah. Uh the best thing that happened was like they had the IV in my hand for some reason. Like they didn't even attempt my arm. Maybe there's a reason they do that. But the best thing that happened was that it fell out partially. It fell out of the vein or the artery or wherever they put it. Do they put it in a vein? Yeah. It fell out of the blood vessel and filled up my hand. So my hand, do you remember my hand looked like? <laughs> I don't remember that. At it all. looked like when you blow up a glove. Mm -hmm. That's what my hand looked like because the IV was just pumping fluid into the tissue and so anyway I was like please can we just have the thing taken out and they agreed and I just like drank plenty of water no, to stay hydrated I don't remember that at all yeah so hopefully that happens again because they just I mean I know it's like more fluid is better than not enough but they just use so much fluid that you end up so swollen whoa oh it corrected itself weird that we're gonna have somebody in there in a couple of days somebody. okay I need you to put lotion on those or out no. what are you pregnant mm -hmm. are you excited to not be pregnant anymore yes yes are you more excited to not be pregnant anymore or meet the baby this is a terrible question <laughs> Don't make me answer that. <laughs> I'm kidding. I got really excited today to meet the new baby. Me too. Well, actually, it was yesterday. I don't know why it like hit me yesterday. Yeah, and it hit me today. Weird. I guess I was just like so focused on taking care of the twins. That, that's kind of the that's been the common theme for me during this whole pregnancy. It's like I know that Rachel's going to be taking care of the infants, so it's the infant. So it's gonna be my <laughs> job to be taking care of the twins. I get called out a lot on calling the baby they. 
Only but, because it's it's gender neutral and it sound it feels insensitive calling it it. So I think there might be like a handful of people that are expecting a surprise twins. twin. Yeah. But it's not twins. No. So there will not be the surprise. No. No. But, it will. It yeah. will be a surprise, whatever the gender is. Right. I think that's been the. So it's a lot of things. Like we've been super busy, obviously, this pregnancy, and. The pregnancy has not been the easiest for me and I don't know the gender. So all of those things make it, have made it thus far not feel like there's actually going to be a baby at the end of this. Yeah. Like I know that there is of course, but like deep down it just doesn't feel like it until this week. And I think part of it was because I started working on, like we're going to do a little bit of a Cre flashback creative flashback stuff for the birth vlog and i wanted to get some of that stuff already done so that it's more ready so i watched a lot of footage of the day that bear and lindell were born today mm -hmm. that got me pretty excited yeah that's awesome so hit that subscribe button so you could be the first to see what gender the baby is what we name the baby let us know your final guesses why don't we just do it now? Final guesses below on what you think the gender is and then like throw in weight and length. <laughs> Everybody loves to guess like the weight and length. Yeah. Everyone loves baby birth stats. It is fun. Mm -hmm. Check us out over on Instagram. We're going to announce it there first. So Brad and Rach at Instagram and have a great rest of the day. And if you want a hint, Bear and Lindell were... Bear was six pounds, seven ounces. Linda was six pounds, one ounce. So this one will be 12 pounds. Right. 12 and a half.